hey everyone welcome back to the channel hope you all are doing well today i am back again with my topic of zabbix today i am going to guide you if you guys were facing any kind of hurdles or issues with your upgradation of zabbix i am going to guide you how you can upgrade your zabbix server from 6.4 to 7.00 you simply have to type on your browser upgrade notes for zabbix 7.0 i will provide you the links and url under my video description first of all what what the steps we have to follow we have to set these these values in our database so for the confirmation after that uh we have to upgrade our php version because for the latest zabbix version 8.0.0 php version is required and currently with 6.4 zabbix server we are running 7.4.0 so let me show you my zabbix server version which is currently i am running this is the 6.4.16 so let's start the configuration and upgrade for our zabbix server to the latest version so i have logged in my in my database i have to run this command okay because i have copied the from the website it just copy my sql as well if you read this note once the upgrade has been successfully completed the option can be disabled then we are going to disable this option as well and these are the installation and upgradation instructions we are going to follow first of all we have to stop our zabbix server Okay, I have to exit from database terminal. So I have successfully stopped the Zabbix server service. The next step we have to stop the Zabbix proxy if running. Uh, currently, I am not running Zabbix proxy on my Zabbi on my Zabbix server, so I am not going to run this command. Backing up the existing database. backup configuration file php file and zabbix binary so i am going to do the same these are very simple steps you just have to copy these command and run these commands after that php file and zabbix binary if we were ran into any issue then these backup files will be very important for us so done till here now we have to update repository configuration packages before proceeding with the upgrades update your current repository package to the latest version currently i am running centos 8.5 so i am going to i am going to add that repository with this i am going to change a bit to run because if i follow the these steps from the zabbix website i am going to run into an error so i have done some research and no currently i uh, i got no error so i am going to continue with these steps let's see if we face any kind of issue during the upgrade
the total download size is 12 MB it will take a bit time to get these packages download earlier before I I got into an error during my installation so I have done some R&Ds for the smooth installation but currently I am not facing any kind of error so let's see also we will finish upgradation without any error If you have the faster internet speed, it will take about maximum 1 minute to download these 12 MB size packages. The package download process has been completed. The next step we have to enter why to proceed these upgradations. It has successfully done. So the next step we have to do we have to start our the big server. I have successfully started now I am going to access my Zabbix server in GUI this is the error we are going to face for this step I am going to guide you how you can do the upgradation for your PHP uh, follow this website to upgrade the PHP version for my Zabbix server
Okay guys, I got this error. Oh, while I am installing this uh, repository or the package because currently I am running CentOS 8.5 and the uh, script provided on the web is this so I am going to change it according to my requirement please note down that I will provide all the links which I am using in my installation so I am going to change this and again I will run this command and now it is successfully completed so what is the next step so I am going to install some uh, utils for the purpose of PHP requirement after that I am going to check that the PHP 8.000 is embedded in my Zabbix server or not as soon as this PHP error will be removed we will done our successful installation see yeah now we have some modules available I am going to run this command after that we are going to run this command I am going to select 8.3 PHP the latest one After that we will check that what is the current version for our PHP is. The PHP installation has done successfully. Now we are going to check what is our PHP version is. PHP version is 8.0. 3.9 now we are going to refresh our browser the PHP error has been gone and you simply have to log in your Zabbix server GUI in your browser and you can clearly see here what is the Zabbix server version and you can also verify from the CLI as well what is the current Zabbix server for our Zabbix server this is how you can upgrade your Zabbix server and install PHP version as well so we are going to disable those settings which we have enabled you guys understood the configuration scenario and upgradation of Zabbix server very well please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends colleagues and students please support me for my channel and stay tuned until then stay blessed thank you for watching goodbye